Hello, Galaxy of Heroes. Uh, this is this is my main account. My uh, this is Mike, as you can see. Um, oh man, I so I deliberated quite a while on what I was going to do here um, to get to see what was in the rear. Uh, I wanted to make sure that there wasn't any like Galactic Legends in yeah. So. And then I was kind of pondering, what on earth am I going to use? And I decided that chances are they'll have held back their GBA because they can see that I've got a, a Galactic Legend in Ray. Um, you know, we all put Ray on defense and use our supreme leader Kylos. Um, so, yeah, I, I took a punt on that, that he wouldn't. And then, yeah, decided that I would go with my Sith. And, uh, yeah, I was a bit shocked. Because um, I was expecting this to be more straightforward than it was. And I dropped banners on this one. But, um, yeah... This was the opener. This was just the uh, the loosener upper, as as it were, so to speak, to coin a phrase. Um, just yeah, just trying out. Oh, where's Nest? Bah! That was the other reason why Triumvir are in here is just the fact that oh yeah, Nest is still a pain to me. Thorn in the side, so. Uh, go with a proven comp on that and work on other things i knew that i had my first order um so if there were some a gn ocean squad in in the back i was covered because i could and i have used um them to clear uh gn oceans they're pretty cool on that as well you know that's the crew lead and stuff and of course i still have my supreme leader if if and when required um, and here I'm just trying to build up the health again, I think. So, uh, yeah, we're just padding out. Come on. And it's slightly speeded up anyway, just to, uh, yeah, get through all the animations and that, whatnot. So, boom, bing, boom, even. Got our first win. Second one is the uh, Shat Clones. Um, come on, I can't remember now. Probably would have helped if I'd watched this back because, um, yeah, yeah, I've got like the attention span of a goldfish, apparently. Uh, who am I going to use? Oh, yeah, Empire. I opted to go the Empire route. Um, yeah. We needed a, a Relic 7 Palps. Um, he, he's quite good, Palps is, strangely enough. In fact, Palps should be, or maybe we'll get a different Palps, because just uh, <clears throat> going through the movies, um, it, it took what it, it took the Dryads, or whatever they are, the, the two of them, to, um, to put him down. And the, they were... Like the ultimates on good and bad or light and dark. Light and dark, that's probably the better reference, isn't it? Oh my days. Um, so yeah, yeah, maybe we'll get another Palps. Maybe that will be the road ahead. Who knows? Sorry, I'm just I'm just thinking back to uh, Jedi Academy earlier on today. And um, gap fill in while I... So I I must admit, there was, there was part of me part of me a large part of me giggity that was kind of like have i cocked up here because um no one's got any protection left and they're proving problematic have i screwed up and then somebody goes who goes not chewy oh yeah look at this this is the relic clone wars chewbacca yes that was it I knew there was something I needed to point out here. So this is, so yeah, Clone Wars Chewbacca and Mace as well. And um, yeah, uh, not not the greatest banner haul here. But it was kind of like, uh, I just didn't want to use 
Are we going to call this a meta squad? I don't think we are. If we, if Bastilla was in there, I mean, you know, slap Bastilla in for uh, Royal Guard, and this squad can be can be very naughty. Um, but then, are you gonna commit your Bastilla to that rather than potential Galactic Legend Ray counter? So yeah. So anyway, happy days. No Gian Oceans. Um, We've got Newt, <clears throat> Newt Seps, Mid Relict, and we've got JTR. So, oh, I've got a vid coming out here. Um, yeah, yeah, just seeing Kylo there. Finally. Finally got, I'll just, I'm just going to say it because I'm, I'm happy and I ain't got anyone to tell it to at the moment because nobody's on chat and my daughter, strangely enough, ain't, ain't that interested. Um, got my ultimate ability on my Kylo. Yes, back of the net. Um, now I've just got to do 10 more times to get uh, Rays. But at least now I'll have an ultimate Kylo to do some and switch them over, I believe. I don't know, haven't looked. Um, so, there's one down. So we've got mid-range JTR resistance there that's not too bad, I would say. Not too bad. I mean, slapping R2, you know, R2 and BB in there as well makes that a uh, different sort of squad to worry, you know, um, pose more problems. But, yeah... Um, opted to do this one just uh, yeah uh, I took my Grandmaster Yoda to Relic 7 in fact he's the only Relic 7 in this squad um, I've only recently took Jedi Knight Revan to Relic 5 I believe Jolie's at 5 Hermit's at 3 the minimum that was required for the Luke event and um, I think Bastilla is also five. I think I may have taken it to five. I know she's got a ridiculous amount of speed. I had, remember having to work hard to uh, hunt, you know, hunt out or, or move mods or whatever. Uh, I've got to be honest. I'm just waffling here as we finish off the uh, the grievous thing. Um, I'm more a case of go find mods are equal to than, than move them um, I'm a lazy modder once I've got them at a speed that I want them I can't be doing with all this chopping and changing um, part of that is the fact that there's a mod cap and I'm constantly on it and yeah it gives me the raging hump I still don't understand why there is a limit to how many mods we can have and then we have a gazillion training robot training droids or something or you know yeah. Uh, so where are we going now? Oh, this is against the bounty hunters, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. I still um, still like to do this uh, CLS. Uh, they're just yeah great against the bounty hunters, and if you can manage them, manipulate them or whatever, um, you can cut down on the amount that they'll heal and stuff. So we've already got rid of Bosk, obviously. Um, Django and Boba kind of killed themselves, so... Yeah. Big bada boom. Group hug. Off your chop. Well, by group hug, I mean kind of like a group blast or whatever. I don't know. Um, so now, of course, I've got all these lovelies, and who do I go with what? And I opt to go with the Hux lead. Hux is five, Sif Trooper's seven, Kylo's seven, Phasma is whatever requirement she was. I believe she may be five, is it? The requirement for Supreme Leader? Yeah, I think it was five. So she's five. Um, yeah, and this one, uh, wasn't too HP about because I really seem to make a whole meal of this as well. But yeah, it is what it is. 
the the one thing I suppose that I would say on that is that I I also try and use squads that I enjoy. And does that sound weird? But you know, getting to use certain tunes, it just just makes your day. And at least with Grand Arena, you get the opportunity because you're not just facing Galactic Legends and Gas. They, you know, everyone has to set other squads as well. So at least we get that. Um, so we got the uh, malevolence there. So that leaves this uh, JTR, isn't it? Jedi training ray. And what am I going to do here? So we go with the uh, the Sith Empire, and of course the best to go with Sith Empire is uh, Mister Mustachio and his headset mate Lobot, because. Um, there's a challenge where we got to get a, a win with them present. They don't have to be there for the entirety of the battle. They just have to be there at the start of the battle. And um, I, uh, so my first round I lost because stupidly I pitted. Oh, did I? Oh, that was it. I put, I put my Rolo, my Rolo lead with her Zeta, with Lando. Um, Captain Hahn with his Zeta and Lobot and I pitted him against Phoenix stupid 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 move cost me cost me the battle uh, they lost and um, yeah that second one cost me otherwise it would have been a much closer run thing um, so here we go on to the last one and this is where I just decide to mirror. Um, uh -huh. I, I was going to just mess about with. Um, oh, I'm going short. Um, short handed as well on, on this one. But then I've uh, unfortunately, well, unfortunately, for, fortunately for me, um, I've got the high ground as such because my malevolence already is seven star, whereas of course he's still um, building his up. I don't know how far away he is. Damn, if it's too far now. Um, but uh, I did, I did take my IG two, well, my IG eighty eight. To relic seven i still need to do the mods to be honest um so it's not all 6e mods as yet but uh i'm just loving this that ship uh, under the malevolence or whatever is just very oh, it's just great fun and i'll have to try actually bounty hunters uh, we'll get we'll get a chance at that because i think that's one of the one challenges coming up so um not that I'm suggesting, but if you're in shard chats, perhaps you can all agree and <clears throat> and possibly put ships or fleet up that that bounty hunters can take down. Um, but there we go. So um, I'll pick up my heads in the clouds award, yay, and my baron whatever title. So that's done. As you can see, the rest is almost there, um, and that is the round. Thank you for watching.